Hello guys, my name is Eric Trach and today I'm going to show you how you can quickly create a backup of your site and restore it if you need to without any problems. For that we're going to use Akiba Backup, so if you, don't, if you don't have the component installed, please do it. Okay, so we navigate to Akiba Backup component and the first thing, the only thing right now is basically Backup Now. You hit the button the page reloads, it gives you a form, you can change the name of the backup so that uh, let's say that we want to know that it's done before upgrading Jump Social, so it's like our backup before the upgrade is done so we're gonna call it upgrade JS backup taken on Wednesday the 19th blah 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 and no comments because I don't need to and we click backup now you're waiting for the progress bar to finish Okay, so the backup is done. Let's go to manage backups because that's what we need to do. And you can see that this is the backup we have taken right now. It's called upgrade. Okay, it's done today. The duration 45 seconds. Every information we need to have, we have it here. And now let's download the backup because we want to have it locally or on some other server, not in the same place where you're pages obviously if that goes down if your file system goes down or anything goes down everything goes down and including your backup so make sure that it's stored in a safe place okay the backup is done I have downloaded it and now let's say that there's a problem with the site right I need to restore it real quick uh, there's some kind of emergency let's say that the front end doesn't work at all ah there you go there's a big 404 component not found uh, okay, so the site is broken, I want to restore it. What I need to do is to use uh, the Akiba Kickstart. You can download it from Akiba's uh, website, it's basically a script, it's not a, like an installation package or anything, it's just a script uh, that you upload to your server, uh, to the root catalog of the server, which I'm gonna do right now. So the root catalog of my Joomla is open, the directory is open, now I'm gonna use the kickstart and just drag and drop all the files to the root directory of my Joomla so I just uploaded the kickstart files uh, now I need to do, what I need to do is to upload the the backup file so let me locate quickly the backup file and just upload it to the server, to the root, again the root directory the backup has been uploaded to the server, you can see it right here, right? Uh, this is the file I'm really interested in. So after the you have uploaded the kickstart to the root folder, to the root directory of your Joomla, and after you have uploaded the backup file, the JPA backup file, what you need to do is basically go to your domain name, go to your site slash kickstart.php it's going to show you the interface for restoring your website so let's close this let's pick the archive file which we are interested in and uh, you probably noticed that it's already automatically detected that's because the script is in the in the same folder as the backup files so i know that i want to use the latter backup file i don't have any password for it i want to fi write files directly not via ftp and most host hosts uh, allow this, uh, no fine tuning, and extract files. Run the installer. And as you can see, it's uh, really similar to Joomla installation. A really nice overview of your server requirements if you're doing like migration. But this is a quick. Uh, this is a quick backup on the same server, the same settings, so I don't need to adjust anything right here. It's taken automatically from the backup. I just go next. You can remove the installation folder and visit your website. So I just did a full restore of my website. It works okay doesn't show any errors whatsoever so I know the backup works. For more information on how the Akiba backup works, how the restoration works, uh, I urge you to view their videos. The links are visible on the screen. They are really detailed and they give you all those little nice uh, specifics for uh, let's say doing a migration.
So this was just a quick restore. If you have any questions, please visit our forum, our documentation, and I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day. Bye, guys.